Hey, Mike McGrory here from Mike'sBackyardNursery.com. In this video, I want to talk about um, using wood chips from in tree trimmings from tree uh, tree services. You know, they when they trim trees, they grind up all the smaller branches and they produce this byproduct, which is everything from leaves to wood to stems to twigs and all kinds of stuff. And people ask me all the time, can I use this, you know, in my garden? Can I use it in my nursery? And the answer is, well, sort of, yes, eventually. Now, this stuff is great if you have, like, uh, areas where you kind of want to walk away to get people out of the mud. You can use it for that. But what I did is I had these tree services just dumping this stuff here, and every once in a while I'd bring it back, the tractor back, and I'd push it up into a pile. And then this year I've decided to get more organized with my composting efforts here because eventually I want this stuff to compost down and then I can use it when it's really good compost, I can use it to mix with the uh, pine bark fines. I use pine bark fines for my potting mix, but I, I like to add you know, 50, 10, 15, 20% of compost to, the, to that pine bark so it's got, there's a little bit of nutrition in the compost um, not much in the pine bark, but it also retains some moisture because the pine bark drains really quickly. So I, I want some compost in there to, you know, enrich in the mix a little bit and and to drain. So anyway, this is pretty much what, what we're starting out with. You know, this is all just wood chips and twigs. You know, the leaves that were in here have already completely disintegrated. How long this stuff has been here, I don't really know. Maybe what I have in my hand was delivered here last year. But then along here, this when we go on the, over on this side of the pile, this, this entire pile right here was all wood chips from tree services. Now you can see now that that's it's, it's very, very different. Whoops. So this is really composted pretty well. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm taking this and I'm making these piles a little bit smaller. I, I actually I started one. Let's walk over this way from here. I started making a windrow, and I was taking relatively fresh stuff. We put all of our composted stuff back there, and that includes hay, straw, donkey manure, dead plants, whatever we clean up around the nursery. So underneath of there, there's a lot of coarse stuff that's relatively fresh, and I covered it up with stuff from this pile. But I think I'm going to make individual piles that I can go around with the front end loader and, and uh, turn. So this is this pile I just started. You can see it's got a little bit of everything in it. Now what I'm going to do is I'll cover that with some of the fine compost. If you look straight over top of this pile, that's our that's where we've been dumping all the manure dead plants hay and straw and stuff over you know over a period of a few years that is the inside of that pile is really really composted so i'm going to make these individual piles that i can get around with the tractor and turn now most people don't have the benefit of a front end loader i, I did this kind of stuff for years without a front loader but if you have a pile like this you can turn it with a very small tiller like a manis tiller right below this video i'm going to put a link down there and, and i'll do a page about this and then i will include some videos of how i actually mix soil and so on with my little manis rotor tiller so anyway um that's my my theory on composting wood chips from tree services people ask me can i use it as in my potting can i use it as a potting mix the answer is no you can't use this as a potting mix because when you first get it, it's way too coarse. Um, the wood is decomposing and it's going to pull all kinds of nitrogen. And then as it decomposes, it gets too fine and it's not going to drain well enough. But it's a great additive to mix into the potting mix. And at the same time, once this is pretty well composted like this here, I could put that in a grow bed and, and just grow things out in it where the drainage thing isn't the issue like it is in a container. So there are a lot of ways to use this and it's really, you know, for years people have called compost black gold and it really is. So this is a way to use tree uh, uh, clip clippings or, or tree chips from a tree service. Most areas they give it to you free because they're just looking for a way to get rid of it when they're working in your area. So anyway, 
there will be a link at the bottom of the video here for more information, more details. And on that page, you can ask me questions and um, we can have a discussion about this. So I'm Mike McGrory from Mike'sBackyardNursery.com. Thanks for playing.